I just don't know what the world is coming to. Everybody knows that lot of gangsters. All you got to do is look at them. Why are they locked up? No, it doesn't work that way. You're telling me. Look at all that commotion in Barbrook the other night. And black fellas causing bother. I, I don't think they caused anything. They were just... All right, Nick. Don't be going all ethnic on me. I never meant that. Yeah, well, you said it. Yeah, well, I never meant that. Listen, what I meant was... You just forgot who you were talking to. That's what you meant. Ah, now if I had forgotten, that means I don't judge you by your colour, doesn't it? You were so wound up by them, you just forgot, that's all. No, I wasn't. All I'm saying is that, well, there's certain types of trouble that you can detect, so therefore you can avoid it. Why not letting certain people into places? Exactly. Like that lot there. Or like our Leo and Jerome into Bar Brookie. No, I never said that, did I? But... Well, now you come to mention it, here you are. Now, what if you went in there for a quiet baby and you couldn't get near the bar for a bunch of drunken Albanians? What do you want? That's the way it's going, mate. I'm telling you that if we keep swanning around the world, solving everybody else's problems, then offering free homes to all kinds, then it's, then it's going to get worse, isn't it? Are you doing this deliberately? Doing what? We're stood in the middle of a bomb site and you're spouting all this garbage just to wind me up. I know you're a sensitive sort of fella, mate, but there's no attender here. Oh, isn't there? Mr. Dixon. Right. 